And our top story tonight, younger children are now eligible to get the COVID-19 vaccine. Thank you for staying up with us tonight at 11. I'm Anthony Austin. I'm Heather Crawford, the CDC director, giving the green light tonight after approval today by an advisory panel. So this means that children between the ages of 5 to 11 can get a lower dose shot. The US has already bought enough shots to vaccinate 28 million children. So now many of you may be wondering tonight when and where can I take my child to get vaccinated? On your side, Robert Bradfield is in the newsroom with those answers for us tonight. Robert. Well, and you are going to have to be patient. One Jacksonville pediatrician says doses should be available by midweek next week. Another green light given to getting more Americans vaccinated against COVID-19. Children 5 to 11 are next in line, but Jacksonville pediatrician Ryan Cantville says it may be a week before the first coast sees its first shipment of doses. We were told today that we should be able to order next week, and hopefully that means we will be able to get the vaccine in our office and uh, available for the children, hopefully next week. Cantville says the organization the state of Florida uses to distribute the Pfizer vaccine is retooling the packaging. Children 11 and younger will be getting a third of the dose people 12 and older receive which means the dose will be put in a different colored vial. That's why if you call your pediatrician's office today, hey, I want to get the dose, we're all going to say we're excited, we will get you on the schedule, but we don't have the vaccine in yet. The state hasn't released that yet. We are hopeful that that will happen next week. The shots will be available at the same locations where doses for other age groups have already been given. Some of the country's top pharmacies and grocery stores say they are working to have doses available shortly after this Wednesday. Cantville's daughter was part of a vaccine trial and says she's not had any adverse effects. The data that we've seen in the pediatric population is not only it's effective, but it's also safe. Some of our hospitals, including UF Health and Wolfson Children's Hospital, have not yet received the lower doses. The St. Johns County School District does not have a plan to administer them, and Duval County Public Schools says they are looking into it and will get back to us. Dr. Canfield says now is also a good time to get vaccinated against the flu, and he says you can get both shots at the same time. Live in the newsroom tonight, Robert Bradfield, First Coast News, on your side. Robert, thank you, and we've made it easy for you to find a vaccine site near you. Right now, you can text the word vaccine, V-A-C-C-I-N-E, to the phone number you see there, 904-633-2402. We'll send a link to your phone with all that information.